conference since we've never exposed ourselves to puppeteers before. <laughs> so, without any further ado, no. Um, so we're a, a little. I'm a little bit nervous here, and I thought, gee, after all that up banjo music, I should come on and do something really up to get you uh, tapping your hands and clapping your feet and. Uh, getting in the spirit of this. So I, I did, I brought my guitar too so I could do, just get your attention. <laughs> and uh, so I used to do folk music and in those days I knew what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to come running on and do something like they call the Wind Mariah <laughs> or an up-tempo song and uh, see unfortunately I don't do any up-tempo songs. <laughs> I have one. No, I have one. And, and uh, it's a kind of a rock and roll song that's kind of back now. And fortunately, it's not very long. So why don't we just get that out of the way right now? <laughs> Take you to the hop, gonna take you to the hop, gonna take you to the hop when your face clears up. <laughs> That's it. Uh, for my next number, I, <laughs> this is a, a, a cowboy song. It's a very sad cowboy song. I've never been so lonesome in the saddle since my horse died <laughs> and I have a little I also I also have a little science fiction Christmas carol I thought I'd use up before the season came around and this song I will sing unaccompanied without my guitar if, It came upon a midnight clear and ate everything in sight. <laughs> Before I get on to the next part, there was one song that I've had a lot of requests for, and unfortunately it's a song I really don't like. But I really like, I, I really like the introduction to this song. And then I feel like if I do the introduction for this song, then you're kind of required to do the song. You know, rather than to do some other song that you really like, if you, anyway, here's the introduction to this song. It's a song I'm sure most of you know called The Streets of Laredo. But a lot of things that people don't know about this song is that it started out in England. And in England, it was not, it was not about a cowboy. It was just about a young man. It was called The Young Man Cut Down in His Prime. This was the name of the song. And in the old English version, he was not cut down by a bullet wound. He was cut down by a social disease. <laughs> yes, that one. That's the one. Really, that's the truth. And then... <laughs> There's a carrier here tonight, I think. No. And then the song changed to the young trooper cut down in his prime, same, di same disease. Young sailor cut down in his prime. And there was a young girl cut down in her prime. Uh, and I don't know what a prime is. I think it's like a little thatched hut of some kind. Uh, could be. Then the song came across the ocean, came to this country, and the disease left the picture, and the bullet entered the picture. But it, <laughs> it entered the picture in a different location than we're used to. <laughs> now this is, this, the original line in the song was, I am shot in the bowels, and I know I must die. But that's so unattractive. <laughs> I mean, can you, can you picture Fester on Gunsmoke, for example? <laughs> It'd be a, a whole different limb. Anyhow. <laughs> so, <laughs> so to alleviate this terrible problem, what they did is they moved the bullet up. So now the song is, I'm shot in the breast, and I know I must die. And that's the introduction to the song. Now, you see, now I have to sing this song. Because I... And... I haven't, I haven't sung it for a while, so uh, if you'll just bear with me, I'll be fine here. As I walked out in the streets of Laredo, as I walked out in Laredo, 
one day I spied a young cowboy wrapped up in white linen wrapped up in white linen and cold as the clay I see by your outfit that you are a cowboy you see by my outfit that I am one too. We see by our outfits that we are both cowboys. If you get an outfit, you can be a cowboy. So you're not a cowboy. I have two outfits. You take one of mine. Now you have an outfit, and I have an outfit. And in our outfits, so oh, don't we look fine? You fit in my outfit. I fit in your outfit. Our outfits were outfitted fine. They're fine fitted outfits, they're outfitted fine fits, they're fit out. I'm fit to be tied. Settle down. As I walked out in the streets of Laredo, as I walked out in Laredo one day, I spied a young outfit <laughs> wrapped up in his cowboy, wrapped up in his outfit, so I let him lay.